I'm Jamin Delane Watson. Thank you so much for tuning in today. Today we're going to be discussing delivering images to vendors after the wedding day. How I do this, why I do this, and hopefully you can learn something from it as well. So after every wedding day, I send all of the vendors involved in the wedding the gallery that the couple receives. This way they can look through and select images that apply to their individual businesses and use them for their Facebook marketing, social media, all of that stuff and their website or blog as well if they'd like to do that. So some of the reasons I do this is I really want to establish great relationships with vendors. I'm here to help them and as photographers we have this amazing ability that the work we do helps other people market their services. It's really unique if you think about it. We're creating photography and what do a lot of small businesses need? They need high quality images. So this is too good of an opportunity to pass out. So it's really important to have systems in place so that you can really capitalize on building these vendor relationships and hopefully these will lead to more relationships you can build with potential clients through these vendors talking about you and referring you. So the first step is creating a client questionnaire that you send before the wedding day. I send a wedding day questionnaire six weeks before each couple's wedding day and on that we work through various details of the timeline but we also have a section all about the vendors of the wedding day. So I specifically ask for hairstylist, makeup artist, caterer, ceremony venue, reception venue, DJ, any other details like jewelry, bride's shoes, bride's dress, groomsman outfit, um, just going off the top of my head here, event table rentals, favors, like all of that kind of stuff. Um, florist is another huge one, of course. So I get all of that information at least um, well, I send it six weeks before the wedding and I always receive it before the wedding day. So then once I receive that questionnaire back, I can create an Excel document of every vendor involved in the wedding day. So I can have their name, their email address, their website. I can also make a note of their Facebook name, name their Twitter username, their Instagram username, and I think that's all the columns that I have. So I have this Excel document set up so when the wedding takes place, it's not difficult right afterwards to email them the blog post or email them the gallery because I have this full list in an Excel document with their email addresses right, right um, beside it. So that really helps me by being organized rather than after a wedding day you're worried about like editing the images, getting the blog post up, to spend that time to like look up all these individual email addresses. It's really helpful to just have it laid out there. And that's also something if you have like an office assistant, it's a task that you don't necessarily need to do. You can have someone do for you. It just helps you be more organized. So when I email the vendors, I send them an email and I say, hey, it was really nice to work with you at so-and-so's wedding on this wedding date. Sometimes I'll say like at this venue. I love the work you did. Personalize it a little bit. Obviously, if it's like a bridal store, you're not going to say, I love the work you did. You're going to say, I love the dress that um, Jessica wore at the wedding and it was absolutely beautiful. Below you can find their gallery. I hope you find some images that you'd love to use in your, your marketing for your business. Feel free to use them on your Facebook page, Twitter, Instagram. If you'd like to tag me, my username is at Jamie Delane. My blog is jamielaineblog.com. I'd love if you'd send a link back my way, uh, but there's no obligation. I just want you to have these photos and use them, and I hope you enjoy them. Love, Jamie. So I send this email out to every vendor within a month of the wedding day, hopefully a little bit quicker. And it's so awesome to see replies coming back from vendors. They're like, oh my goodness, thank you so much for sending these along. So I think vendors are really used to having to email photographers after the fact and track people down to receive images. So they really, really appreciate it if you're proactive. So if this is something in your business that you're struggling with or you'd like to have a better system, I'd really recommend implementing those client questionnaires that I talked about having an Excel document with everything lined up, and then having a pre-written email so you're not individually typing every email. You have a rough template that says, hi, so-and-so, here's the gallery, here's what you can use on your Facebook page, here's my, like all those details that I talked about. Having that template ready to go, and that's gonna make communication a lot easier, and it's really gonna improve your vendor relationships and hopefully the referral business as well that's, that comes your way. So if you really enjoyed this video, if you learned something from it, I would love to hear from you in the comments below. I'd also love if you'd follow me on Instagram and Twitter at Jamie Delane or look me up on Facebook. It's Jamie Delane as well. You can always read my blog at jamiedelaneblog.com and I'd love to have you subscribe and share this video with a friend. Thank you so much.